enjoy the show and try to avoid grounding threats from Roku Kanda Viander, Harry Strack the Go Animator, and Paper Luigi 99. Because everyone all over social media and YouTube said that grounding threats don't work. And you know what? They're right. Grounding threats don't work at all. So please, try to avoid those types of threats as much as possible. Thank you. And enjoy the show. This video takes place after Kelu cheats at the final exams by using the invincible phone to cheat for the history of the final exams. And boy, this bitch Roku-kun is gonna get it now. But let's not start drama. Okay. But why, Jesse? If you shut your pie hole, she'll tell you. Thanks, bestie. Now, this video is brought to you part by Dreamily. Dreamily is a creative AI companion for anyone seeking for new stories. You can create a world and start a story with this world or speak with its characters. That's right, Joey. You can chat with your favorite characters, make voice calls, multiple writing styles, share your creations, and more. Plus, you don't have to pay for it since it's free, unlimited, and free, with no subscriptions required. You can also make scripts for your favorite movie, TV shows, video games, and more. So no need to worry about writer's block anymore. Now that you have the Dreamily app with you. That's right. You can play with Dreamily wherever you go, on your phone, or on your computer. Don't think of AI as taking over the world. Think of it as your best friend. Think of AI as a tool that can help all of you. Dreamily AI. Multiverse. Multiverse written, written by, by you and, and AI. AI. Download the app today. And don't forget to enjoy the show and avoid grounding threats. Oh my freaking god, I can't believe my son came up with the idea to turn his phone invisible to cheat for the final exam. He won't get away with this, don't worry Mrs. Clementine, I will deal with this problem with my son. No problem Boris, oh, and before I hang up. Your son will be obliged to go to Christmas school after the school year ended. Because if he doesn't come to Christmas school after that, he will be automatically expelled from our school. And also, I forgot to tell you that. Since your son got a F- in his final exam history, his teacher teared his answer sheet to shreds and he'll be receiving detention every day. That includes recess, lunchtime, and after school. So... I will call you every day about your son, since he receives a lot of detention at all times, except class time. Wow, he received serious consequences from his teacher. Kalu would be so dead right now. And thank you for notifying me again about this. No problem Boris, bye. <laughs> oh my goodness gracious. What a crazy dream I just had. It was so real. My dream was about me talking to Boris that Caillou would be obliged to go to Christmas school after the school year ended, and he'll be receiving detention every single day. Wait. Don't tell me. Did Caillou actually turn his phone invisible to cheat for the final exam? I better get to the school and go to my office and look at the security cameras to see if Caillou turned his phone invisible to cheat. It's true. He actually did turn his phone invisible to cheat for the final exam. Odd. No wonder no one came up with the idea of making his phone invisible. But wait. Who's here along with Caillou? Huh? What's Roku-kun doing here? Good morning Mrs. Clementine. You seemed early today. It's literally 6 in the morning. Oh hi Mrs. Martin. I was just checking the security video for when Caillou turned his phone invisible to cheat for the final exams yesterday. And you are not going to believe what I'm saying right now. But I have the same dream that is actually my vision of Caillou turning his phone invisible to cheat for the finals. Um, can you speak normally? I'm not sure how well I understand what you said. 
What do you mean you're not sure how well you understand what I'm saying? If you don't believe me, then look at this. Rokukun has a scheming face when he tells Caillou to turn his phone invisible to cheat for the final exam history. Um. Okay. So what you're saying is that student Roku can force Caillou to turn his phone invisible and make him take all that responsibility for cheating? Yes. Well, I guess that explains why no one ever comes up with any ideas regarding Caillou cheating for the final exam. Exactly. But, um, are you sure that Roku Kun is responsible for causing your dream to come true? Yes, I am 100%. When all students are inside the school at 7 a.m., I am calling Roku-kun down to my office so we can discuss the situation further. I'll be waiting for him there. But for now, let's have some coffee in my office while I continue with my morning checkups. Okay. We need to talk now. Roku Khan, we're going to have some serious talk today about the cheating of students on the exams. I want you to start by telling me everything that happened yesterday between you and Caillou. Okay. I've already talked to Caillou's classmates, the whole school, teachers, and even staff. I saw the footage of you forcing Caillou to turn his phone invisible for the final exams. I know this isn't your usual behavior Roku-kun. That's because Caillou is not good at sports. Don't play tricks on me mister. This has nothing to do with what we're discussing right now. You need to explain yourself, or else you are going to lose more than just your suspension today. Well, I'm not exactly the best athlete in this school. Mrs. Martin? This kid continues to lie and fool on us so we're being stupid enough to believe his ridiculous story. Look Mrs. Clementine, the truth is that I didn't push Kaitmu into doing what he wanted to do. Shut up! If you don't know what we're discussing about, then look at the cameras to prove that you have no knowledge of what happened. You're not getting out of trouble this time by lying. Now are you ready to tell me the truth, or are you stupid enough to fool us once again? Okay. You win. I made Kaitu to turn his phone invisible so that he wouldn't have to take all those extra detentions. I do it just to get him in trouble and watch him being abused by his parents by giving him punishment days. He deserves punishment day with lots of violence and humiliation so people who know him like us won't suspect anything. Besides, I love watching Caillou's parents giving him punishment days. It always gets me happy. You blue haired mother freaker. Do you even realize punishment days are against the law, child abuse and torture? You got Kalo in big trouble and now you still have the nerve to say you love to watch him suffer? I cannot freaking believe what you just did to my poor student. You really know how to mess with my student's mind. Now because of you, he suffered abuse, and even if he survived, that doesn't erase all the bad things you did to him. Oh, it's obvious you're going to get arrested for breaking into our school and forced him to turn his phone invisible to cheat for the final exam. Now you're going to pay for your actions. You are hereby expelled from this school. Screw the school. In fact, screw getting expelled. Why should I even bother staying here anymore? I knew this day will come and I knew it all along. I've already set all of the bombs and everything is now ready to blow. 
Wait. What the heck are you saying? You'll see soon enough. I've been preparing the bombs ever since I've said one foot in your school. I got a detonator in my backpack just in case this happened. See? Holy freaking crap. How could you have a detonator in your backpack? And where in the world did you get that detonator from? It can't be from a store. No, not store. Just a random trash bin in the alley behind the school. In just 10 seconds, all this building will be blown sky high. Are you crazy? That would destroy thousands of lives. How could you possibly think it's a good idea to blow up our school? I'm not a crazy person. But I must admit, it's fun while it lasts. I've waited months for this moment, and it finally arrived. I have to warn my students to evacuate the classrooms. Students, this is not a drill. All of you must leave this school immediately. The building is going to explode in 10 seconds. Well, I'll see all of you in hell. Holy crap, Mrs. Martin. We've got to get the hell out of here before the building blows up. The school is ancient history. Oh, um, hi Mrs. Clementine and Mrs. Martin. What a pleasant surprise. And I thought all of you got killed, but you're still alive. Pleasant surprise? Do you think this was a pleasant surprise for you? You freaking idiot, you hair kid, you are... First, you made little girl blow the whole school up with a bomb. Second, you made Kalo explode the school with his fart. And now you explode the entire school with the bomb. How freaking dare you? You're lucky you didn't kill any of us along with your classmates, staffs, and teachers. And do you even realize how much money and damage you've done to our school? It'll take a million freaking dollars and we don't have enough money to find the cost of the new school and repair the damages you've caused. This is the second time our school blown up with Harry's track to go animator. Who's next to explode our school, huh? Paper Luigi 99. Or maybe you want to try another explosion with some fireworks. You're going to be so busted right now when the news gets out about everything that happened today. Don't expect any mercy after this. I'm going to report this incident immediately to GMN News. Once word reaches them about this fiasco, every journalist in America and the world is going to know that you're nothing but a criminal and child abuse supporter. You may enjoy seeing people being tortured and destroyed, but we are not going to let you get away with it. But not only that, you are never allowed to come to school again once I found a new school, because you are now expelled for that. Do you hear me? You are so ill all The freaking expelled, expelled, expelled forever. Which reminds me. I'm calling the police and you're gonna get arrested for this as well. Do you understand? You're going down. And I hope your stepmothers from Indonesia and Malaysia will hear about this as well. Now stay here and don't go anywhere while I'm making the call. Oh shoot. My stepmothers will seriously kill me when they find out about this. This is your son and you will be staying here for six months. And there will be no freedom such as smoking and drinking. The only thing you will have available to eat and drink is whatever's given to you by the officers. The original classic disgusting jail food just for you. And you have visitors who wants to talk to you. Well, get ready to have your ears bleed like all of the videos I made on my channel. Oh, hi stepmothers. What a pleasant surprise. Nice of you to drop by. Kejutan ya yang menyenangkan. Apakah menurut anda ini adalah kejutan ya yang menyenangkan bagi anda? Dasar bajuan berengsek. Oh 
error, 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 Dangun kan ini juga akan tetap di atas dan di luar video berdasarkan kaido beradaan lift lebih tinggi dari kan kami. Kami tidak memerlukan anda untuk berjalan ke atas terdiri itu dan anak anda sedara di rumah anda di tempat dengan undang undang dan pendirian kanak kanak anak anda sedang sedang bertapa berbayar di Amerika anda ambil dulu semua raja segera anda renda berada pada tuan. Kami juga ada membayar kerja kan lebih dari lima juta dolar. Bagaimana bisa kita mampu membayar jumlah ini? Kami pelan pelan untuk kamar pensiun kami setiap hari kerana perilaku destruktif anda jangan terlalu rus dan kita kalau anda jangan pelak perlu. Aku tidak berkaya apa yang pernah dilakukan hari ini. Saya sedia serta mana melangkah untuk melakukan segala anda sekarang awal lagi. Saya tidak pernah berkaya bahawa berkaya seperti itu akan berlaku. Terima kasih banyak awak si kepada yang kila. Anda benar benar telah merosakkan kehidupan keluarga kami yang sempurna. Saya tidak berkaya anda akan melakukan sesuatu yang kila dan berbahaya ini. Anda amat memalukan keluarga kami yang sempurna dan amat keluarga kami. Sungguh ibu mengherankan. Kau benar benar ini yang kita kuatkan sampai sebulan mulai lagi. Anda lebih baik tidak mula kau akan apa pun atau kami akan menuntut pancat anda. Tapi dengan kata lain, setelah kamu dibebaskan, apa kamu tidak tahu apa yang terjadi setelah kamu melakukan hal seperti ini? No. Wait. Punishment day? Oh come on, I've suffered more than five years of punishment already. If you guys plan on doing this again and again, then you'll need to- Dia! Kau tahu hukumannya jika gagal. Jika gagal? Wait. No. I mean, you're kidding, right? Diam! Kamu tahu hukuman yang menanti kalau kamu gagal? Hadi sediakan diri anda. Selepas seis bulan, kami akan mengeluarkan video ini dalam talian. Dan kami tidak akan teragak-agak untuk menjaman anda dan menjekat saluran Youtube anda. Dan perkajalah, kemaran chica gaga jaule viteru karipada kemaran ibu tiri anda. Malah, sudah tiba masanja untuk merasakan kemaran jale via walkeran asaja memberitau pegawai tu jika tirak menggapa. Sedia? Teruskan.